like shit! Captain Buttfuck decided to show up. And what, without the rest of Team Shit Show? Hmm, good luck. Oh, don't be like that. Hey, 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 sweet cheeks. Will you get my friend here a drink? Just a water, man. Not beer? Two beers? Oh, this is a prime player in my spank bag. He's got an ass like a woman. So fucking licious. I mean, look at that. Look at that. Pop, 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 pop. Pro tip, you intimidate them, you get faster service. <laughs> you know you could do the same thing with a smile and a compliment. Hey, man, that was really fast. I really appreciate it. Thank you. You fucking fake. At least I'm honest. You're a goddamn swindler. <laughs> You're a swindler, too. That's why you brought me here? Hmm? What if I told you there was a bunch of homeless people prowling the streets, their bodies infused with experimental nanotech? I mean, think about the kind of exposing and the uh, truthing you dead sack D bags could do with that kind of information. I mean, an army of robo hobos that don't make you wet. For real though? For real. It's called Project Rincense. How do you know about this? Because the first volunteers were from my crew. Oh, your crew. First rule of asshole club is don't talk about asshole club. Ha 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 ha. Here's the thing about biohackers, right? We want to be pioneers, so we take big risks. To Rincense. We had a lot of really sick grinders and nothing cool to show for it, so we stopped volunteering. And I'm supposed to believe that Rensense just turned and started kidnapping homeless people? Sort of. You'd be amazed what a bum will do for access to a mobile clinic. Fuck off, you're just trolling me. It's nanotech. Transmitting a tracking signal, 910 megahertz. Go ahead, scan it with your UHF, I'll wait. Okay, so what? Your little vial is transmitting. It's been real fun, Lenny, but I'm not crawling in the mud with you. Oh, you totally are. Don't call me again. You're an ambulance chaser. You can't resist this. Hey, Marcus. Welcome to Asshole Club. I think I gotta check out Lenny's info on the homeless deaths. It doesn't hurt to check it out. There's a lot of interest in nanotech in the Bay Area. Many people believe it's the next major step in human evolution and body modification. Plenty of biotech companies are experimenting with it. Sounds like you know a bunch about this kind of thing. I want wings. Can I get wings? Can you imagine me with wings? That would be so awesome. That's theoretically possible, however. Unlikely in the near term. All I'm hearing is a lot of blah, blah, blah. Yes, you can have wings, Wrench. Stop pestering Josh. Come on. Wouldn't you want wings? <laughs> wings! No. You know what kind of hell that would be managing clothing with wing holes in the back? No, what I'd want is nanotech tattoos. They can change their patterns. That would be cool. That would be pretty cool. That's much more likely to happen. We may even have the technology for it already. <laughs> Rock on. Matching dead sec nanotech tattoos.
I'm at the homeless encampment now, guys. Time to start digging. Yeah, we did some digging of our own. Anything good? No, but a lot of bad. Higher than average deaths among the homeless population. A noticeable spike. Oh, that's definitely bad. Yeah, what do you want? Hey, uh, I just heard about those mobile clinics down here. Just wanted to learn more about them. Why? You look like you could afford a real doctor. Look, this is my hood, man. Just wanna know. Fine. What can you tell me about it? Showed up about a month ago, offering checkups, shots and things totally free. You just gotta sign some waiver saying they can keep your info. <sighs> that seems kind of weird. Maybe. I don't know. Hey, those guys that died, did any of them go to this clinic? Yeah, I think so. Uh, you should find Marty. He went to the clinic and home. He's looking real sick. Where can I find him? He's around here somewhere. Lay down yesterday or the day before. He hasn't got up since. Thanks, man. Looks like I better go find Marty. What have we here? Pamphlet all about free medical clinics. <laughs> Why, yes, I'd love to know all about that. Hey, buddy, you doing okay? Yeah, 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 fine. Just uh, can't see straight right now. You want me to take you to the ER or something? What? No, doctor no. will just make it worse. I was fine before the doctor. Did you go to the free medical clinic? Really or are you saying you felt worse after you went? Oh, nurse said the shots make, made me feel Ooh, sick for a few days. Yeah, I guess. Guess. I'm not going back. Oh, no. I saw what it did to Marty and Joseph. Oh, no. Marty and Josephine? Joe's dead. Marty will be soon. Do you know where I can find Marty? No, he lying on a couch nearby. Lay down yesterday. Hasn't moved since. Oh, poor Lord have mercy. That was sure as hell Carver at all. It's getting Hang worse. in there, man. What am I going to do about it? Nothing. Did you hear them fencing off Maurice Town's No! Some goddamn <laughs> Fuckhead! Goddamn twit! Holy shit, man. Hey, hey, you want some help? I'm all right. Doc says I'm good. I'm doing fine. This will see me again next week. <coughs> the doc at the mobile clinic? Yeah. You need something, kid? Look, I'm, I'm, I'm actually just trying to find out more about the clinic. What they're injecting people with. I don't know. Just shots. But when I, I saw one of the docs throw away the injector gun thingy, it's in a yellow can somewhere around here. Hey, that's useful information. Thanks, man. Sure. Injection gun. Looking for an injection gun in a yellow trash can. Pills, not a kick shit. 
don't care about anybody, but... Feels like I'm in a cyberpunk sci-fi movie. Hey, Josh. I found an injection gun. The guy I talked to said this is what they've been using at the clinic. Excellent. Sending you data now. I'm using it to update the scanning app Lenny showed you. You should be able to use it to scan for more nanotech. That would be useful. Yes. Mm. Looks like they do broadcast. You should be able to use your phone to track down where people with nanotech have been. As you get closer, the signal will get stronger. Who's your dog? Uh, thanks for playing. Keep away. Come on, boy. Who's a good boy? Come here. Maybe he'll come back on his own. Yeah, but he might lose the bag. Who knows where he'll bury it? He took a bag? Uh, what was in the bag? Hand bones? <laughs> Well, this not my bag. It belongs to one of the doctors. The dog, you know, just sort of snapped it up. Thought it was a toy. You know, like, like dogs do. <laughs> uh-huh. Yeah.
Hey, anybody in there? No. Kind of just gave yourself away, dude. I thought maybe saying no might give you the clue that I didn't want to talk. Fine, fine, look. I'm just trying to find the mobile clinic. Oh, no, don't do that! Shit, look, I, I, don't do that! Listen, you may be stupid, but no one deserves that. Don't go to the clinic. I just want to find out more about it. They trick people into free healthcare, inject us with tiny machines, and watch to see if we live or die. Eh? You know it all. That was, uh, a lot of information. I know it sounds crazy. The police didn't believe me either, but the clinic staff, they heard me. <laughs> and, and now they're trying to kill me. That, that's, that's why you hiding out in the back, Kay? Oh! Oh! If anyone asks, you didn't see me. Right. Nanotech. Fuck. Lenny may be right. Nanotechnology could solve hundreds of medical problems. Diabetes, blindness, deafness, autism. Not to mention enhancements to our natural abilities. Yeah, all of that is pretty cool. But doing research on the homeless without observing humane testing conditions. Yeah, would you do it? You know, try nanotech for, you know. Being non-neurotypical? Maybe. The experiment would be worthwhile, but... Only if it were reversible. I like who I am. I might not like who I would be if I didn't have Asperger's. Yeah, that's a good point. How much of that shapes who you are? Hey man, uh, what kind of dog is it? I don't know, it's a fucking dog! Sorry. Come on, boy.
Josh. Yes? Our friend Marty, aside from being completely passed out and scanning positive for nanotech, looks like there's an injection wound on his wrist. And what do you want to bet they injected nanotech right into his bloodstream? I wouldn't be surprised. <sighs> I guess I'm not surprised either. Jackpot. I think I found that bag the dog stole. Looks like one of the clinic doctors is going to be missing their bag. Anything useful in it? Comb, gum, clipper card, and official staff ID. Complete with barcode. This is going to be useful, I bet. I think we're on the right track. Definitely nanotech research going on here and not the authorized kind. I would agree. We need to track down whoever's behind this and shut them down. Best bet for that is the mobile clinic. One of our scouts saw mobile clinics in the Prescott area. On it. Ow! Now! There's been a disturbing rise in gang violence recently here in the city by the bay. A trend that is inversely proportional to optimal happiness in social order. Yeah, hi, this is Bo. Uh, I just want to put a, a 
this song out to all my, my boys because you know they've been backing me up every day and it's really cool. So you know, it's, you know, this is you guys, man. It's, you know, you're my brothers, right? Okay.
try to put your hard line with us, dog. Good to see you. Yeah, same. 
So fill me in, what have you found? Honestly, looks like your standard run-of-the-mill medical clinic. They do have some computers set up, of course. Expect you'll find more info once you hack into their system. And the doctors carry around these data pads. Those probably have info too. Seems likely. I'm gonna see what I can get off the doctor's data pad. Good call.
get the drop on me. Oh crap! Got it. And it's winging its way to you. We'll get right on this. I have it. Decoding the encryption shouldn't take long. Got it. Ren sends us keeping people prisoner. They have several of the missing homeless under observation in their facility. I guess that explains the disappearances. Found it. Time to put these guys out of business. And leave a little virus to remember us by. So long as they don't actually remember us, or identify us at all. Yeah, figure of speech, Josh. Right.
Hey, you! Don't move!
One down. Looks like the police are trying to keep this whole thing pretty quiet. Yeah? News stations are being told it's some sort of minor illness among the homeless population. Regular citizens shouldn't be worried. Right. Who cares about the homeless? All the deaths do seem to occur within a three-mile radius of known mobile clinic locations. That's two. Who said you could be here? Are you kidding me? Glad I'm not you. Three down. I'll meet you at the Rensense building. Sounds good. Anyone else want in on this? Wrench and Satara are working on their own projects. <laughs> cool. So I'll meet you there and we'll see what we can do about freeing some people and destroying some nanobots. It's a plan. No way. Uh -uh. That's right. Right. Who the hell? Get over here and help me deal with this thing. my name? You had your last warning. We need better laws.
Why do we keep doing this? Why can't I look away? Huh? God, this pisses me off. God damn it! I need help! This is what you get. Calling units 1031. An APB has been issued for an escaped felon. CTOS is tracking the suspect's coordinates. Approach with extreme. Find him and you mess him up. We clear. Huh. 